Why didn't you guys enter the door? Oh, I'm sorry. I forgot we were your personal butlers. How would his lordship like his eggs? In a bucket, smothered with more eggs. Wait a minute, don't distract me. <gasps> the delivery guy's still out there. He's walking towards his truck. He's reached his truck. He's opening one of the back doors of his truck. He's putting my package into the back of his truck. He's adjusting his pants. He's still adjusting his- Just get out there and talk to him. <laughs> I caught you. I can take my package now. I'm sorry. <laughs> You're confused. For my fancy clothes, you must think I'm some sort of wealthy lord. But I am actually Richard Watterson, and that package is for me. So I'll take it now. <laughs> no, the package has been entered into the system as undelivered. It will be returned to the depot as per subsection 37B of company procedure. But I can see it. Can't you just give it to me? Yeah, sure. I'll just give it to you. If rules and regulations mean nothing to you. So I can have it? Do you know where we'd be without rules and regulations? Right here, but I'd have my package? Life would be like a giant cage fight without the cage. Wait! You missed the delivery. You could pick it up at the depot or pay for a re-delivery. The choice is yours. Good day, sir. Ah! Oh, there's no way I'm going to the depot. And I don't want to pay ten bucks for a re-delivery. Well, just lie. Then they'll have to re-deliver for free. Great idea. I'll tell them I'm a ghost and couldn't open the front door because I don't have a physical body and that they shouldn't discriminate against me because of my spirit status. Or just say the delivery guy didn't ring the doorbell. No, uh, I like mine better, but okay. Uh, Dad! You lied? You know who did this, right? Darwin. No, the delivery guy. Oh, yeah. How dare you lie and say I didn't ring the doorbell? You have dragged my spotless reputation through the dirt! What was once perfect and pure has been ruined, like a white dove wearing hoop earrings.